Transurfer and welcome. I am Renee Garcia and this is Transurfing TV. Oh my God. I don't know what's happened to me lately, guys. I am like super happy and I'm just living it, you know? I'm doing this stuff every day and I'm in love. And I love all of you guys so much. Everybody that comments and shows love to me in the comments below and on Facebook and supports other trans servers. My God, this is turning out to be such an epic community. I'm so happy you guys have no idea. So thank you so, so, so much. So remember, like this video if you do in fact like it and comment below, my world is taking care of me to possibly win some of these and also check out our teachable course. The link is down below. So day 66, support. I've got no idea what this one is about, but we about to find out. So let's see what is going on with day 66. If things are hard for you at the, at the moment, you can always find support inside yourself. If you wake up and look at how your problem arose in the first place, the danger lies not in the problem itself, but in your relationship to it. Immersing yourself in the importance of the problem, you give your energy to the pendulum. You have to realize that in any problematic situation, the pendulum will want you either to prepare yourself for a fight or throw in the towel and give in to despondency. You must do neither. So if you have no support and you've lost your iron rod of confidence, what can you do? Confidence will come when you wake up and acknowledge how the game is played. What? You will chuckle wryly to yourself and say, aha, it's you, a pendulum. You won't hook me that easily, not this time. You are no longer a puppet. You are free. God. <laughs> Vadim Zeeland's interpretation. The world can start to look intimidating and hostile to a person who is not familiar with the rules of the game. Surging feelings of loneliness and depression can cause a person to fall asleep and give in to the will of circumstance. When faced with a common problem or unfortunate news, people give their energy to the pendulum and then they feel anxious, lacking in energy and burdened by the pressure of the whole situation. Isn't that like everybody in the world right now except transfers? <laughs> Either they shift into a state of readiness for combat or they just feel hopeless and give up. Both states are abnormal and lead to stress and depression. In order to find support, people chase down the situation by people chase the situation down by smoking cigarettes and drugs and drinking alcohol and turning to other similar kinds of emotional props. As a result, they get caught in bondage to other pendulums. All you have to do is wake up and observe the game as a member of the audience, only without exiting the stage. You will be able to see all the hidden rocks lying on the seabed as easily as if the sea had suddenly evaporated. Then you will be able to come to a position of strength inside yourself. Understanding what is happening around you counts for a lot. Only this knowledge is enough to restore a quiet, firm belief in oneself for lack of confidence usually results from fear of the un unknown. Knowing all of this, you can now turn your life into a clear waking dream and gain control over any situation in which you find yourself. Okay, so for those of you that are really actively transurfing right now, you probably have experienced people asking you, like what the F is going on with you? I know I am, people are tripping in my life, family members, people in my external environment, people are having meltdowns. I see people angry outside. I see people angry at the stores and I'm just kind of like do, 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 do. And people are challenged 
to understand how I'm remaining unaffected. So this is my new theory on life in general. And it's so, so, so simple. And I think this is going to become my new motto. And it is this, you either affect or you are affected. So if you are an affected person right now, you are not affecting, you are not being effective, and you are not being efficient with your energy because something is affecting you. If you are being, if you are affecting, right? You are not, you are not getting triggered. You are not um, being affected because you are the one doing the affecting. So support, this is about you backing yourself up and ensuring that you are the one doing the affecting. You are not being affected. You are not being affected by external circumstances. You are not being uh, affected by world events or things playing out or whatever. My life has only gotten better from this whole last six months of everything, how it's played out, things have only gotten better, but it is because of this concept. So supporting yourself, making certain you are dialed in to what is coming for you and refusing to be affected by it, refusing to get triggered, refusing to become pendulum food. And you become the one that does the eating. You don't get eaten, you eat other things. <laughs> so horrible. Oh my God, this is what my brain does. Anyway, what do you think of this one? Remember to like this video and comment below. I do the eating, I don't get eaten to win some of my reprogramming stickers. And remember the teachable course, everyone, Reality 2.0. Thank you for watching and have a good one. Bye guys.